Today I've decided to do a really simple makeup look using just one palette. And the palette I'm using is the Mineral Radiance Sundance by Youngblood. First of all though, I'm heading in with my Youngblood Moisturizer. This is the Hydrolux Water Cream. Absolutely love this. Now I'm going in with the eye cream, so just underneath the eyes and over the eyes and really massaging that in. Really helps to wake you up. So nice. Now I'm letting that settle in by having a little drink. This is my SPF. This is the Airy Day Mineral Mousse. It's one of their skin screens and it has an SPF of 50 plus. It is amazing and I'm trying to use this as an absolute ritual to look after my skin. Now I'm going in again and I'm going to make sure I get the sides of my neck. That's really important because the sun hits you there and I'm trying to get rid of my pigmentation and also down my decolletage. Sweeping through my brows with a little comb. I'm going in with the On Point Brow Defining Pencil. This is in blonde and it does look like I'm ruffling them up but I do like to get that pencil right down onto the skin to really ensure that I have that color in there. They do need a little bit of a tidy. I'm a little bit overdue but for now we'll just ignore that and soldier on. So just making sure I get any of the excess oil. And this is the Mineral Foundation. This is in Golden Tan. So I'm just using the um, BK Beauty brushes for my look today. This is one of their foundation brushes. They are absolutely beautiful. Loving the handles, loving the bristles, loving everything about them. So placing it all over my face. It's a really natural coverage, this one. And just blending that in over my eyes as well. I'm not prepping my eyes with anything else today apart from the um, mineral foundation. So with the foundation, I'm just really running that in over the ears, down my neck, and I'm also going to put some down my decolletage as well. I do have some broken capillaries there, so I've got a bit of redness and possible sun damage from over the years, so I'd like to cover that as well. Going in with their mineral radiance, this is called the Golden Sun, and I just like to use this. It's just a moisture tint, and it's in quite a dark color, but I use this to frame my face and just carve out or begin that contouring, because I will go in with a powder contour as well. Now with all these creamy products, you need to let them settle in for a little bit. So having another quick cuppa before we go in with our powder products. This is the Mineral Radiance in Sundance. So I'm using the darkest shade as my contour. So really going over that Mineral Radiance that we used before, the liquid one, and just contouring. Now I've used a small brush. This is the one of the BK Beauty brushes, but it's a small angled face brush. Um, ideally, I probably should have used a larger one. So I'm still having a bit of a play with these brushes, also contouring down my nose a little bit. Now I like to use those exfoliator pads to just wipe off excess powder. And I'm going in with the sort of peachy shade to use it as my blush and I'm placing that over my nose. I did miss out the other side, sorry. So over my um, cheeks and I'm using the darker shade again now to contour my eyes. Now I did quickly put on some of that peachy shade on my lips with a little bit of lip balm just to keep this all a one palette look. So running that through the eye socket there, I'm going to grab a fluffy brush, like a bigger brush, and just make sure it's up on that brow bone. My eyes are slightly hooded now, so I do like to do this in order to give them that lift. So the color in the center is a really nice shimmer. I'm using this to really help pop out the eyes and pop that right on the ball in the inner corner. I'm using the lighter shade, which is like the highlighter, and I'm highlighting the high points of my face down the nose, tip of the nose, and my cupid's bow, up under the brows as well, and the inner corner of the eyes. I'm going to use my mineral mascara. This is in blackout, so I'm just sweeping that through. Off camera, I do do another layer, just so it doesn't take too long. And now, this is the medium rice setting powder. So I'm using the bigger BK powder brush to just press that into the face. This powder is beautiful. It's really, really finely milled, and it just helps to absorb that excess oil and really set the makeup. I'm using a more detailed brush for under the eyes. So I really hope you like this look. It's my easy, simple look.